all told, spent 15 years here. And the first five were my favorite when I was a part of the athletics program here at the University of Minnesota. The day has finally come where our drive towards a new facility has turned onto the backstretch. We have a lot of great student athletes as we have had in our program. Uh, I got to spend five years here uh, and it was one of the probably most memorable and some of that had to do with uh, being on the, you know, one of the best teams to come through here for track and field and cross country. Athletic speaking, I had one of the greatest coaches and I had amazing teammates. And over the last few years, we've been taking buses to go around to different places to train and compete. Well, that takes a lot of time in a student athlete's stay. You guys know it's been a struggle for the team, but one of the things that's been great about them is that they have focused and, and focused on doing the job. It's very appropriate that we're here to begin the construction of the long, long-awaited new home for our track and field program. This uh, project has been on the board's radar screen for quite some time. We supported the early planning phases of this because it was important to see a track and field facility right here on the East Bank. It's a testament to our commitment to these athletes who really haven't had a facility to call their own for many years. To have a competitive advantage of having a facility, a world-class facility, a marquee facility that can host these student athletes is amazing. We have sat long hours and meetings together to plan this facility from the floor up. We talk about building this track, it's a 100 year build, you know, not just a 20 year build. This is a lifelong vision um, for everybody. What we're going forward connects the legacy of past Gophers with the future. I'm really excited that this day is coming where we're finally putting this in place. This will do extraordinary things. You know what's great about this track is obviously we'll have a home for our student athletes. We'll have a venue that can host the premier state high school events. We'll have a venue that can host USA track and field events. It's going to be another beacon of this great campus. Bringing a track back to campus is really going to help our program. The benefit of having the track right outside the athletic complex is we can take a few steps right outside our door and work our tails off. We did so much without a track. I'm so confident that we'll do even more with one. We get to be proud of that, we get to defend our home turf, and we get to invite all of you, our donors, our alumni, our fans, our family. Now it's going to be great in the fall of 2018 when we actually have a place for that family that we can all call home together. We wanted to make a difference and see where the next level of generation is going to go. I think you're looking at it right out here. I think it starts right at the University of Minnesota. The reason why I want to donate money and help get a track back on the University of Minnesota campus is because I really treasure the years that I had as a track athlete. Well, I'm surrounded by people who have dreams. And those dreams become reality when people invest in those dreams. And that investment can be through time, through energy, through financial resources. But I hope all of you can invest in this project as we move forward. Because we're going to be able to help thousands of future golfer athletes compete at a competition level track that will be second to none. And that's made possible because people like you invest in our kids and you invest in their dreams that they have.